What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Rico TV. If you ain't brushing, you ain't swimming. All right, before we get into the video, make sure you're subscribed to the channel if you enjoy the content, and make sure you're following me on my Instagram for any updates on any video that I'll be posting. All right, my Instagram is the same as my channel name, so I'ma just wait for y'all to go follow me right now. All right, thanks for that follow. All right, let's get to the video. Just All right, so this is my pattern right now. You know, I just scalped like a couple months ago. I wanted to just change my pattern because I already had the beehive. You know, I just wanted to switch it up, try something new. So, you know, I just try to get the swirl and my swirl is coming in. You can see it. It's not like a bunch of forks like how it was before. You know, y'all can check out my other videos. You will see how long, you know, it's been since, you know, I changed my pattern and I changed it really fast. That's the thing. I'm just showing y'all a couple, couple of my angles, the brushwork I've been using. You know, there's different ways, like there's different other ways to brush with this pattern. So this is just how I brush. You know, I try to make it easier for me, you know, to achieve the angle that I want and it works for me. If you're trying to switch to a different pattern, just just subscribe to the channel, and, you know, and watch these videos because I'm going to be dropping these tips fast now. These tips are coming fast. I've been focusing on just getting my pattern in. And this is the side that I really got to work on. I got to put in some comb work on this side to really make it come in. You know, this is my weak side right now. <laughs> I have to really put some work in on this side. It's going to come in quick. So stay tuned to that. I'm going to be showing y'all all the progress on that, everything I'm doing. You know, these videos are coming. I'm going to be showing y'all what products I've been using. And I've just been using these curved brushes a lot. So if you're trying to get this pattern and if you want a brush that could really hit your angles, I would recommend these curved brushes. All right, get you a curved brush if you want to achieve these angles, all right, for this pattern, this 540, you know, slash 360 pattern. That's why I'm saying there's different ways to brush this pattern, all right? You can have a swirl and you can still have the 360 pattern with it. You know, mine's is like a 540 slash 360 pattern, you know? So stay tuned, keep watching the videos. These tips are dropping, all right? I'm just showing y'all, you know, how I brush the crown too, you know? If you're trying to work on your crown and you have this pattern, just follow these steps. You know? 